Toyota had to give the Tundra a serious tune-up since sales were stalling out. Despite high interest, the Japanese manufacturer didn't venture into the diesel scene, leaving the territory to American truckmakers. The latest gen of Tundra got a fresh facelift and engine upgrades, but it didn't quite hit the mark as the bosses hoped. This might just make the way for the next big play, the Toyota Tundra HD. This is just speculation, but it's something we need to keep on our radar. Toyota remains a player in the truck game. Tacoma dominates the midsize segment, and the Hilux is the most reliable pickup truck worldwide. However, the new Tundra has been showing its weak spots since its debut. Restoring the pickup's image is critical, and rolling out a new flagship model could be the perfect way to grab attention. While the Stout is a compact pickup, the true truck enthusiasts will be eyeing the potential heavy-duty Tundra. There are only three heavy-duty truck lineups on the market. The leading US truck makers are duking it out in this segment. Ram HD, Ford Super Duty, and the GM Twins all come with similar offerings. To start, each model runs on big and potent V8 gas engines as the base setup. Truckers, seeking for the max towing capacity, usually turn to diesel power plants. Properly configured, these beasts can haul 40,000 pounds. This is the main challenge that slows down the Japanese company. The competition isn't big in quantity, but it's huge in quality and performance. Achieving such impressive numbers and meeting the heavy-duty truck market demands is no easy feat the Tundra HD needs to be everything the regular half-ton Tundra isn't. Toyota's known for rock-solid reliability, but the latest Tundra has thrown a spanner in the works, with too many issues and glitches that loyal fans aren't used to seeing. To be a contender, the heavy-duty Tundra will need potent engines, both gas and diesel. Toyota ditched one of its most reliable and durable V8s in favor of a more efficient turbo V6. There's also a hybrid setup, which could be adapted for the HD segment if paired with V8. But a petrol-only setup won't cut it in the heavy-duty realm. The truck needs a diesel powertrain to match the output and capabilities of the existing rigs. Toyota has been dragging its heels on this. Tundra and Tacoma enthusiasts have been waiting for years, but oil burners never happened. Meanwhile, rivals have been cashing in on diesel's superior towing muscle. In the heavy-duty realm, Toyota can't hang without the high towing capacity that such engines bring to the table. It's not the first time gearheads have been dreaming up the Toyota Tundra HD. A few years back, there were whispers that the company might roll out this beefier version of the half-ton pickup. The concept builds on the standard Tundra, with designers stretching the cabin a bit and throwing in some slick color options that Toyota might actually borrow for their current lineup. But the heart is missing. The engine. There's no diesel drivetrain in sight that can slot into the Toyota Tundra HD and make it a real contender. The trusty old 5.7-liter V8 gas engine could work as a base-level option, but without an oil burner, it's hard to see the heavy-duty Tundra keeping up in the new world. It's hard to believe the Japanese company will change its stance towards diesel powertrains. Fans were hoping Toyota was bluffing when they said oil burners wouldn't be available for the Tacoma and Tundra. Recent drivetrain decisions show the engineers are sticking to the plan. Instead of V8, the Tundra now features a turbo V6, and the Tacoma swapped V6 for a turbocharged four-cylinder plant. Hybrid systems are making everything cleaner and the ultimate goal is a zero-emission truck. However, Toyota needs to play catch-up here, as all the US truckmakers have already rolled out their concepts.